It's the American dream right here on Long Island. We've had a lot of interest, but uh, as they say, no cigar. Happy birthday. Oh my God. Looks like the Millennium Falcon. There's still time to, I don't know, maybe uh, take the edge off. You meant Millennium Falcon in a good way. Yeah, definitely. Charlie is not the guy that I marry. I mean, a, a bus, a robbery, an accident, but Lyme disease? Divorced and separated parents let their kids get away with murder. The kids went up to drugs, God knows what else. I'm out of my house 18 hours and 45 minutes, and you're Dr. Ruth now? She's a sex therapist, Mick. And I saw it on Donahue. It is true. Adriana <laughs> Bragg, 15, now in the 11th grade. Do you think I'm a tramp? No. Well, I'm not, OK? I'm not like my mother. I know that. Oh, so you think my mom's a tramp? It was weird seeing you get your ass kicked. <laughs> are, are you okay? You can call your mom if you want. She can bring you an uwu or something. I felt like you were like my uh, my little brother. Really? Your brother. Does it hurt? Oh, I'm sorry about that. Oh. <laughs> And why are you even warning yourself with uh, my problems with your father? What kind of my problems, too? I'm gonna, but I break my ass for this damn. Oh, you spend more time with your fig tree. Hey, my mother got me that fig tree. She told me not to marry Irish. Welcome to our wonderful little family and our perfect little suburban life. Have you ever thought of me as more than just like a brother? I said, look, Herb. What did I tell you about this world? You're either chasing something or you're running away from something me I chase. When a girl's wearing mistletoe in her hair, pretty much means one thing. Maybe you should have had a girl. They tell their mothers everything. Well, maybe you should have asked God for a mother who doesn't care about her children. I've already lost one kid because of my problems with your mother. I don't want to lose the other. I would let you in the heaven. And this tiny little bug, no bigger than a pimple, would change your life. I never knew I could hate anybody as much as I hate you, Charlie. Do you really think we should talk about it? I'm asking you a question, soldier. Answer me. Never, but you know what they say. You hit a guy like this. Boom.